French Radio Student Golf Lima Sierra is taxiing for a departure off 07. Welcome to another episode of Learning to Fly. Thank you so much for watching these episodes. And I am overwhelmed that I have already reached 500 subscribers. So thank you so, so much. If you haven't subscribed yet, but you watch these videos regularly, it'd be great if you did. Click the notification bell as well. So let's dive straight into my return flight from Clench Common to Kemble. And I've got some interesting information for you after this flight. Golfly Miss Sierra is backtracking 07. Student Golf Lima Sierra is taking off 07. Okay, 200 feet, flaps away. Circuit height. There'll be a little bit more thermal activity on this. Thousand feet. French Radio, Student Golf, Golf, Romeo, Lima Sierra is departing the overhead to the north. So we should be aiming for 335. Three, 3 basically. Okay, so we said goodbye, we've got 30 litres of fuel. Radio, we're listening to Enstone, just in case there's any joining traffic. Engine temperatures and pressures are good. We're at 60 on the coolant, 60 on the oil temperature, 3.6 or 7 on the oil pressure, which is fine. Frida, direction, yeah, we know where we're going, we're on 335, which is good. Uh, we're heading for Swindon, pretty much, between Swindon and Bassett, I can see the two now and uh, direction altitude change to the Cotswold pressure well actually Q and H Q and H I should say rather than Q and H so yep yeah, we're going in between Rural and Bassett and Swindon Lynham is off in the distance to the left there so that's great and uh, our, we're, we're aiming a little bit too right so we should be closer to Bassett so let's just make that gentle turn that's good I mean, I think I could see Kemble from here, you know, it's it's really not a long flight, it's only just qualifying for a cross country actually. It's This could be my first bit of cloud surfing.
There's some. <laughs> uh, just got to be really careful with VFR rules because there are some clouds coming up. I think I need to drop a little bit. Coming up to the M4. Fuel is 30 litres, radios. Let's listen to Campbell now. Engine temperatures and pressures are good, 60, 60, 3.6. Uh, direction, well, we know where we're going. We've got the GPS. I mean, I, I actually can see Campbell already. So I'm not... Charlie Alpha, Alpha, Vicky, Delta, continue with sight. Vicky, Delta, continue with sight, Golf Charlie Alpha. It is just the most amazing hobby. So lucky to be able to do this. Absolutely amazing. Absolutely so lucky. So yeah, I, yeah. I mean, I know I, that's Campbell now. So everything now is just checking, really. My, uh, so let's do some proper navigation. Why do we know that that's Royal Watton Bassett? Because really, po polar like Campbell should be on the nose, and it is. To the left of what I think is Royal Watton Bassett, what we're above, above now, is Lineham, and you can see Lineham in the distance. So that, that for me, is, is proof. We should have the small wood on our nose, we do, some woods, and we should be crossing the M4 any second. And guess what? That's the M4 down there. So this is an absolutely stunning day today. So navigation wise, we're sort of here uh, at the moment, so I should have the lakes coming up to my right which are just there, Kemble's on the nose, I mean it's a really nice navigation. Excuse me Golf Golf Romeo Lima Sierra is inbound for the rejoin. Golf Golf Romeo Lima Sierra, Romeo zero 08 right hand, uh, QFE 1010. Zero 08 right hand 1010, over head join is it? Uh, that's the standard, unless you want something else. Sorry, yeah, overhead joins fine. Student Golf Lima Sierra. The overhead. Wilco Golf Lima Sierra. So, we're going to do another free that I've changed to them because I can slowly do a cruise descent in a minute. That's Kemble there. And we're going to lift the wing. Golf, Golf India, base leg, runway 08 to land. Golf India, port final. Golf, Golf India. So we're going in for the overhead join. <laughs> My radio wasn't great there. Um, they're so helpful there, and they're all they want to do is help you. So I just wanted to ask if it was the overhead, but it is. So Golf, Golf Alpha. Golf Alpha, continue with size. Golf, Golf Alpha. Golf Golf India 08, land your discretion 0504 knots. We know what it's doing, so, okay, so let's do another free Golf Golf India radio. We're at 28 litres. Radio, we're listening to Campbell, we know what we're doing there. Engine temperatures 60 on coolant, 3.8 on oil pressure, and just under 60 on oil temperature, probably a bit low to be fair. Uh, we're on a cruise descent to 2,000 feet for the overhead, so I want to be at 2,000 feet by the time we enter the ATZ actually, so I'm just going to drop that a little bit more. Uh, engine direction, direction. Well, we know what we're doing. We're seeing Campbell at the mo at the moment, and we are looking for traffic now. Altitude. We changed to the QFE, which I made a note of, one zero one zero. So we've got five hundred feet to lose just as we come into the ATZ as well. And uh, yeah, that's that's all good, really. All right. That last time I was really messy on my overhead joint height, and that wasn't great. So I'm, this time I'm going to nail it. Two thousand feet. So I've really had to up the revs there. I've got a bit of speed to bleed off, so I'm going to do that. Trim up a little bit, because I am a little bit quick. That's bang on 2,000 feet, which I'm really happy about.
and uh, I'll be driving down that road later to work. <laughs> Student Golf Lima Sierra is overhead. Lima Sierra, thank you for joining Crosswind. Wilco Golf Lima Sierra. Uh, yeah, I believe he's outside the hangar. Yeah, golf, golf, Alpha, yeah, uh, same person, uh, come in at about 8 o'clock this morning, over. Uh, Roger, thank you. Golf, Golf, India's closing down on hotel. Golf, India, thank you. Student Golf Lima Sierra is joining Crosswind. Student Golf Lima Sierra from Port Delaware. Wilco Golf Lima Sierra. Student Golf Lima Sierra is downwind to land, zero 08 grass. Well, Lima Sierra, pull final for the grass. Okay, we'll Golf Lima Sierra. Right, trim, we're good. We're going to come back a bit actually, just because I am fast. That's fine. Uh, wind is looking light and down the runway, actually, zero 07. Actually, a slight crosswind from the left, from the north. Uh, all clear, yes, we are. Security's good. Fuel is good, 30 litres. Undercarriage should be fixed and locked. Temperatures and gauges are fine as well. And we're doing what we did last night, which is nice. So a really good check final because I'm quite, quite short here, but that's fine. that first stage of flapping. Straight down the runway, that's nice. Student Golf Lima Sierra's final to land 08 grass. Sierra 08 grass, land your discretion 0406 knot. Landing Golf Lima Sierra. There we go, we're going to get full flap in. Stable approach, 75. 200 feet. Uh, Lima Sierra, request backtrack. Sierra, backtrack. You can vacate Golf 3, continue to Woodside. Vacate Golf 3 and we'll continue to Woodside. Thanks, Golf Lima Sierra.
Awesome. Awesome. Bloody brilliant. Really enjoyed that today. Well, there we go. My second solo navigation cross-country exercise has been completed. So what, GST now? Not quite. Unfortunately, as of filming, I was three and a half hours under my solo flying time. You have to fly 10 hours solo. So the nice thing is I've got to do a fair bit of consolidation flying before my GST. So that's actually quite a good thing. I need to fit in a few extra flights here, there, everywhere, when I can, according to when the plane's booked, when the weather's good, if the instructor's about. So I'll do my best to fit these in as soon as possible. Because as you can imagine, I really, really want to crack on now. And a lot of people asking me, am I going to film my GST? And the answer is, yes, I will be filming the general skills test in order to get my license. I cannot wait for that. Fingers crossed. Thanks again for watching and we'll see you next time.